เอาเอาเอาขาจากกองมาดีปะมันจะได้นิ่งๆนะยังอ่ะเอาเลยเอาวัดนุติปายเอายังอ่ะยังนะนะโอเค So today we're going to install an iPad Hero. It's an ultra capacitor. It is an energy storage of your battery. Instead of using just um, solely with your battery, you have a storage of energy right here. So the first thing that we need to do is we're gonna set up the battery first if if it fits inside your car, inside your machine. So let's try to put it on. So as you have observed, uh, we have the color black and color red right here. So the first thing that you need to do after after inserting right here, after it fits in, you need to so make sure that it doesn't move. It fits inside right there. And then... Uh, So the, the red one would be your your positive and then your your black one would be your negative. The first thing you need to, you need to follow the instruction and you need to so it is it's a, it is a DIY. You can do it your own, but make sure that you follow the very basic, which is the the positive first, which is the red one. So this is the red one. This is the positive. So you gotta you gotta remove this one first. So you can use an automatic automatic wrench. If your car is new, it's too easy to remove the screw. But if your car is too old, it's you, you need you need also with the screwdriver to remove it. The some some cars are too old with their screw. One of the advantages of this one is um, when you use the ultra capacitor, your your battery would last from uh, two years, most likely here in tropical area. Most of the batteries, I think, we cannot hear you. Um, most of the batteries would last only up two to three years, but if you use the ultra capacitor, it would last up to five to six years. So that's how amazing this ultra battery is. The main reason for that one is when your ultra capacitor is there, all the energy that is lost, it will be stored inside your ultra capacitor. So that's why it, that's why your lifespan of your battery would last up to five to six years. It takes a little while because this screw right here. Okay. Now since we removed the screw right here, we need to put this one first. And uh, try to make sure that there we go. So you can help me out with this. of um, tips when you when you screw it on again um, you just need to use your hand first and let it um, let it fits first so that you don't have hard times <laughs> but you can use both ways either the wrench right there or the screwdriver whatever you think is more easier for you can do it
So with this ultra capacitor, you don't really need to worry about the maintenance because um, as we have mentioned earlier that it lasts up to five to six years. So instead of replacing your battery every two years when you're in the tropical country, of course, um, it differs in terms of where you are at. Example, you're in a country where there's a four seasons. You don't need to worry about. So the next one would be the positive or uh, the negative one, which is the black. So be reminded that red first and then black next. Here. See that it's quite easier um, when you use a wrench. Actually, you can you can just install this one for the next two to three minutes but I think this time it's, it will take us around five minutes so that's how easy it is it's DIY you can do it your own so after you put your after you install the positive one the next is your negative which is the black and uh, you will be able to see right here you'll be able to notice right here that the green light is not on yet so once you or you are done. Sorry. Once you are done with the uh, with the red one, uh, with the with the black one, um, it charges from your battery itself. So still, your primary energy source would be your battery, also your fuel cells, as well as your fuel engine. So before you install this one, you just need to let it stay for a, for, a, for a while, like around 3 to 5 seconds. And you might notice that there's a spark, so it means that it's compatible. So right here we're going to install, you don't need to worry because it's, there's no short right here, the short circuit. So now you're ready to install it again. Um, just making sure that it's in place. See that one? After the spark that you have observed, the green light right here turns turns on. Okay, great. It just take a little while. Just few minutes, just three seconds after this one. And then try to observe after we install this one. Um, your engine might sound the same from before it was installed, but after a few moments it will be quieter. What are the benefits of having the ultra capacitor aside from uh, aside from your battery it would last from five to six years the other benefits of this one is it would your car in terms of full tank your car battery your car gasoline in terms of full tank um, the usual the usual kilometer that you can run from from 400 to 500 it could be if your car is new it could run up to 40% to 60% more. Okay, so now we are we're done. Now we're done installing it. Again, as I've said, you go with the positive, which is the red one, and then the negative, which is the black one. So we're done installing this one. So let's try to turn on your car. And let's see what it uh, what you can observe after turning it on. <laughs>